Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Kenzie Chiefs Franchise. Past couple weeks, we have been playing well. Well, past two weeks, we've been playing well. Yeah, we lost against the Bengals. Well, Raiders with an injury happened. Lost against the Bengals badly. It was worse than it seemed. We lost by like 20, really, not 10. Ended up beating the Jaguars. Ended up beating the Giants. Now we got Chargers. And he po most likely comes back for week 10. Pause. Week 15. Is it the week 15 or week 14 he comes back? Um, Should be able to beat the Chargers. They're 4 and 7. Near the bottom. Not really at the bottom. We definitely could improve to 10 and 2 with a victory here. We are 96 to their 89. I think we should just... We're, we might not win this one. There's a good chance we will not win this one. This team is... Used to be very dominant. Probably still is in some... In some ways, but... Not as dominant as it used to be. We know what the strong suits of this team is. It's definitely the defense and the Chargers. And even our team right now, the defense is basically the strongest point on our team. As you see Melvin Gordon showing off his helmet. We are division leaders at 9 and 2. Chargers are nowhere to be found. They're not in the hunt, not in the wild card. No way. Last time we faced this quarterback, he threw five or six interceptions in the game, as we are still rocking with Deshaun Kaiser. Don't want to bring um, Patrick Mahomes back too early and end up aggravating the injury or making it worse or something. Basically, keeping him up for the playoffs. Why did he take it out? That was a horrible decision to take it out. I didn't want him to do that. Oh, good run. That's good speed right there. I actually got through that when I didn't think I was. He could be the eventual MVP right now. Okay. Do we throw this? Yeah. We got to run that edge very quick. I get this first down. Yep. I definitely got that. Sometimes you gotta use your legs. Even even though I hate personally, I hate using my legs. I feel like it's a little cheesy way to get first down, especially you got a very good mobile quarterback. You don't even need a good mobile quarterback, really. Well, you kind of do. Don't know how you overthrow that. He's literally the closest person to you. We will be taking our three. And the kick was almost blocked. That puts us up 3-2-0 in this first quarter. It's like about half, half, half the clock. Away. Their quarterback is having a decent season. 17 touchdowns, 10 picks. I didn't see the yards. I looked like at the last with it. Chances are they will run the first play. And they do not. They actually pass the first play. Out of bounds he goes. Good. Needed that drop. Out of bounds. And they get nothing. They get a yard on their first drive. It's not good. Because if anything, they're going to come on that right side. Good stuff. Overthrown. That's a throw you have to make. Honestly, you really do. 
Had the right idea there, trying to throw it to the sideline, but he led him just a little bit too much, trying to get it out to his receiver. Ends up falling to the ground incomplete. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40 yards. Four rushes for 51 yards. Good for Looking good early on, at least. A real first quarter stake with their seeing from this unit so far. Right now, they've decided to sit, as you said, establish the run game, and they've been successful. What? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me, yo. This is annoying. It really is. It's either we're missing throws or receivers aren't going for it. Good way of staying your feet for at least five. Four or five. Here we go! What blocks? What freaking blocks? Oh, come on. If I get that speed out there, that's a touchdown. There's no one catching him. Third and long for Kaiser. Flush to his right. Touchdown on a one. I'm so glad he made that pass. Because he has been struggling to hit that. Like almost any pass, actually. Got it. And this will increase our lead. 10 zip. Almost out of the um second first quarter. Extra point right down the middle. I'm and thinking we in the second quarter. The Their offense is line. not doing much for them, honestly. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's us sending pressure or them not being able to handle the pressure. But they're not really getting anything really. Oh, I need to press that. What? No pressure getting in? That's crazy. Oh my god. I got in. I got like some pressure in. And then we got nothing. Like absolutely nothing right there. And then it made me dive like backwards. Like what the hell was going on with that? Red blitz got him into the right protection scheme so he doesn't get hit back. Come here. Blitz coming and down he goes. Yeah, we need that right back. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Going right side. That goes out of bounds. We get a decent amount of yards on that one. Fourth and long. Didn't look so hot offensively. This second quarter, though, they've looked really good. They've jumped on the saddle in a big way now. They all got in on that one. Good stuff. He's not going down easily today. Nine rushes for 81 yards. He's damn near getting 10 each drive, so. It's a little more difficult on him. I think I should run PA crosses. Oh my gosh. Really? He threw it too deep. Route took too long to um develop. Pressure was coming in. Very scary stuff. If I can... Whoa, that was not to him. Okay, that kind of messed me up. There's a cover us that could be open here. Just run. That's a late hit. Give me them yards. Give me them yards. Like, I should have called that a couple weeks ago. Yes, I'm still on that shit. I'm going to save the game because we should have called it. Like, I wouldn't be in a situation with my quarterback if they would have called it. 
So long as we didn't get much after that, though. Before he throws it into us. So, wow. Okay. Or we will take our three. We're just we're, we're, we're taking our time with the ball. We're, we're handling the football pretty well. He's missing a lot of throws, so that's the thing. It's not like I'm like. Like, I'm making bad reads. He's just missing throws, and I can't do nothing about them. Like, he just need to hit his throws, and we will be good. He's throwing his feet. They got that run with ease. One of y'all. Damn. Like, I just watched that ball go down. Ain't doing a damn thing about it. Were they run here? They actually was. I'm not trusting them. They don't run. They throw a pass and this dropped. If I'm them, I might go for it, honestly. That's just me. It's fourth and inches. Like, you're not losing much. Still on his feet. He fought for every yard he got right there. Good catch. Oh my god. I thought he overthrew him. Oh my gosh. This is annoying. It is. I can't wait for next week. I'm so through with this quarterback. Bro. Like, yeah, you played good for us, but you're missing a lot of fucking throws. Yeah, I, I didn't see any way I could go. From the shotgun, it's Kaiser. Dancing to his left. Now he'll square up and throw deep. What a catch. Why does he throw better on the run? That doesn't make any sense to me. It really doesn't. Like, are you that bad that you have to throw off balance throws? Untouched. Never mind. This uh this charge team not looking too hot on offense or defense throughout this game. They're probably gonna take it into the second half for us. They do get ball, so good clock managing by us to make sure we scored. And, then changes things up on you and they will run another play. Not getting much. If they don't score a hit and I score again, I most likely will just sim it because... First of all, it's not fun for me. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it usually is because, like, I'm getting to use a good quarterback and I'm getting to do what I want on the field. Right now, I cannot do what I want. He's missing most of his throws. That's not fun. Like, I need you to hit your throws. And... What did we do? Please don't tell me they call him P.I. Okay, he stepped out. Because I'm like, I'm pretty sure my man did not touch him. A call you rarely see in Madden is um, offensive pass interference. Like, I have never seen that being called. Or I have yet to see it be called. Like, in what situation would they even call offensive pass interference? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm right here. He threw that down on purpose. I was going to insert that. 
At least they, they don't get nothing again and they're forced to kick the ball. Um, I think we scored on every drive we had so far. So, if history tells you anything about that, it's not looking too good for the Chargers. Honestly, it's not. There's honestly no other way around this thing. I just think he's out of here. Unless, um, what's his name come back and do something spectacular? Then I think it's a lock for MVP. With Kareem Hunt. Or unless one of the other guys, like Devontae Freeman or somebody, just has a spectacular fucking season. But honestly, I don't think there's a. I don't think they get any better than this. He's probably going to average over 100 yards on the ground per game. And then when you think about it, it's like almost... There's no line that's really stopping him. Here's Kaiser. Forced out to his left. Caught Kelsey, left side. And he is at quick, quick, and what a terrific play, holding him to no gain. And he's going to be taken down. Pressure oh, just about to throw it. Weirdly enough, he only has two sacks today. Well, I only got sacked twice today. And both of them were by, um, Greg Wilson, so. They do their homework as much as offensive guys do. Improvements, improvements. know where that came from. Kaiser to throw it. Able to shake him off. Oh my god, one of y'all gotta get open. None of y'all's gonna get open. Why would both y'all stand in the same area? Like, I wanted to move one of y'all, but I knew it wasn't gonna work out. We will take three. See, I would usually say, yeah, I'll send it right here because, like I said, I did score, but. Um. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm going to sim. And without me on the field, they end up getting three. And we end up having to punt for the first time. And they end up driving down the field. Scoring. And we're forced to punt again. We do end up getting the ball back on something. And uh, we had a game 25 to 10. Pretty dominating performance. At least when I was playing, it was really, really, really a dominating game. Isn't no other way to put it. Deshaun Kaiser holding his own for his last game, most likely. Uh, let's check out the stats. Their quarterback threw 117 yards for one touchdown. We threw 438 yards, no touchdowns, no intos. Decent. Cream Hunt rushed for 170, 187 yards, two touchdowns. Almost comparable to like two weeks ago or last week where he rushed for like 230 or something. Very comparable. Melvin Gordon didn't really get much. Receiving yards. Their receiver had 107 for six catches. Uh, we kind of spread the ball out. I feel like we didn't throw it that much. It was kind of run heavy today. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what it is. We do come out here with a win, so can't really complain much about that. So next week, we do face a playoff team. Which is very, very interesting enough. We'll be facing the Redskins next week. Do we have a... Yeah, Cream Hunt most likely, right? No? Okay, that must have been last week. It has to be last week. Do you run for 187, two touchdowns? You have to be player of the week. I would think so. No, you're not. Okay. Oh, this is the week. Patrick McCormick returns from injury. This is going to be great. Uh, Don't necessarily need to win, but we can use the win. As we are... We're kind of blowing out the vision. Uh, we basically are a third seed, which I think we should be a two seed, to be honest. Um, With a win here this week, we can... 
We can lock up that first seed in the AFC. That's gonna do for us. Like on subscribe to what you want to see in our next video. But until next video, peace.